I got my foe, and we about to see what's up. I had to take my shirt off. That was my shirt that I wore. I was showing a few houses today. So that's the shirt I wore while I was showing houses. Come on. Just making sure. Hopefully I'm coming in good. Hopefully I'm coming in good on the shot. But this is what it comes with. A little assortment of stuff here. Bean sprouts amongst other things. Goes into the food. Into the soup. They got it all separated. Oh snap. I'm not even sure what this is. Maybe some spicy sauce. I think this is some mint, some fresh mint. Ooh. Whoa. That smells like weed, bruh. This doesn't look like a weed leaf, but I'm telling you, that kind of smells like weed a little bit. So I left my broth in the other room. Some editing magic. I'm gonna go get my broth. Ta-da, I got my broom. I mean, my broth. It's right here. So let me move that out of the way. So I guess I have the bowl first. They give it to you all separated so your tofu won't get all soggy, I guess. So I'll go ahead and pour my vegetable broth they give you on in there. I got my chopsticks. Should I do Hold on, this is going to be my thumbnail. <laughs> mm. That's good. So, I got this in Baltimore on Charles Street. I forgot the name of the joint, but I'll put it on the screen right now. So, it's right down the street from the Grub Factory if you've been there before. This is going to take a while. So, I had a bite of the tofu right when I got it. It was so good. Flavored pretty good. Nice and crispy. Let's get some veggies up in there. I think I need a bigger bowl. Yeah, I definitely need a bigger bowl. But you know what I'm not going to do? Get a bigger bowl. I ain't got time for that. I'm hungry. And then this already made it the 30 minute drive to my house. Well, actually longer than that because I got the food before I showed the house. My client showed up early. That was kind of funny. I don't think I'm going to put the mint in. I'm not huge on the mint. But I will put some uh, some bean sprouts. I love the bean sprouts up in there. Are you a bean sprout kind of person? I love alfalfa sprouts too. Like, oh my lanta. Oh, we got some jalapenos. Let's throw that up in there. Let's throw some more of these bean sprouts. We got some fresh lime. I'm gonna leave the lime out. Not a big lime guy. How about you guys? Hopefully I'll get my wife back on these videos soon. She is launching her channel. Stay tuned for that. That's gonna be incredible. All right, that's about enough because my bowl's overfilling. I should have just poured this in this. You know what? Stand by for a sec. All right guys, so I decided to transfer the contents of my soup into this clear container so you guys can kind of see what I got going on. You know what I'm saying. So I'm gonna dig right into it. Mmm. Season so well the broth. It could use a little salt, a little hot sauce, but it gets the job done. I'm gonna try the hot sauce that they give me. Mmm. 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 Do you guys uh, eat faux soup often? Of course, it's not the traditional foe, it's not beef noodles, not beef broth, this is vegetable broth with uh, crispy fried tofu. You can order soft fried tofu at this place too. So, the rice noodles kind of remind me of eating ramen, but it's a little different. Mm. I really enjoy this. I don't do this more often. The first time I had fall, I didn't really care for it. It wasn't that good. This one, on the other hand, is pretty good. 
See, here's the shirt I took off. <laughs> Let me get some more bean sprouts up in there. I really like some bean sprouts. Mm -hmm. That's pretty dang going good. Looks like my tofu stays at the top. Everything else goes to the bottom. Tofu is still pretty crispy. Piece of cabbage was pretty good. Mm. So they gave me some hot sauce. This thing looks absolutely hot and terrifying. Woo! Woo! That's hot. But that's what I do. Spicy ramen challenge. All right, let's see. Now that gave the, it gave us some uh, color. Let's see if it added a good flavor to it too. Mm-hmm. It added a lot of flavor to this. It takes it up another notch. Oh man. Oh man. Mm. Mm. So I wonder what would happen, right? Sorry, I got this big gigantic hand covering the soup up. I wonder what happened if I put bean sprouts like in some ramen. Would it give me the same kind of feel to it? I like some bean sprouts and some tofu. If you did that, let me know in the comments below. Mm. They didn't give me a spoon to slurp up on the broth. The good thing about this is it's, it's not over salty. You maybe can add a little seed, a soy sauce to it, but I'm gonna leave it be. There we go, we got some broccoli action. You see that broccoli? Mmm. Mmm, mmm. Mm. Well, this isn't my first time having pho. It's my second time, but it's the first time I really enjoyed it. Mm -hmm. The last time I got it, I had it with some spring rolls. Oh my gosh. The spring rolls was off the chain. Mm. My word. I hope you guys can get you some of this full soon. So, as far as personal life for me, it's been the same. I'm still working at, a, you know, fixing cars and stuff. I'm doing the realtor thing. That's fun. I mean,. My wife made it look a lot easier than what it really is because I thought you just like show some houses and that's it. But you gotta deal with rude realtors, you gotta deal with rude clients. It's crazy. Mm. Oh, hold on. Got a little jalapeno action. Woo! That was good. Mm hmm. Man, I don't know why I don't eat this more often. It was a pretty good meal. Add some more of this hot sauce. Some more of that sauce. Mix it on up. Let's see what we got. What we got? Mm. It's not no more spicy. See, but I can't gauge spicy. Like, nothing's that spicy to me. Like, you see this? It's nothing. It's nothing. A nice big piece of cabbage. No! See, I'm not that good with chopsticks. <laughs> I mean, I'm not horrible. But I'm not all that. Oh, look, there go that cabbage. Let's try this again. Mmm. 
<laughs> so be quiet. So yeah. Sorry, I had to change the angle a little bit. Cause I hit the camera. Mm. This soup is just about done. I thought it was. I just looked at it in the camera, the the little monitor on the camera. It looked like I got a lot left. Oh, there we go. I thought I was done. Mm. Mm. Thank you for anybody that just watched that and said bless you. Mm. <laughs> oh no. So it is gone. Only thing left is some <clears throat> some bean sprouts. That I'ma try to finish off. Mmm. But Four liter soup is pretty freaking good. I never had it with beef ever. Um, so I don't know how to compare it to what a beef noodle soup would taste like. But vegan pho is just as good. For sure. Pho show. Sure. I heard there's a pho place in Baltimore called Pho 10. And that's funny because that's like that's an area code 410. And it's called Pho 10. Mm. So that's done. I'm done. I gotta clean this table up. The video's done. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Let's get to uh, 100k subscribers before the end of the year. That means I need a lot of help from you guys. You gotta share this on your Facebook, your Instagram, tag me. Tell all your friends that the vegan mechanic is awesome and there you have it